If you are close enough to an enemy, you can miss of the Boston Basher and not bleed. Sounds simple enough, but it's possible that the forgiveness check isn't actually working as it should. Within the code, the acceptable distance to target is defined as melee range multiplied by 1.2. This kinda implies that the intent was for the check to be the length of a normal melee swing, with a bit of extra leeway, since why would you bother referencing the melee range instead of just specifying a number, right? The weird part is that in reality, it's actually much, much shorter than melee range, because distance for this forgiveness check isn't measured in the same way a melee attack is. Distance for the check is determined by measuring from the scout's eye to the target's pelvis. In contrast, melee attacks fire a 48 unit long invisible bullet. It also originates from the scout's eyes, but it counts a hit if it intersects a player's bounding box. So, the forgiveness check ends up traveling farther, since going from the scout's eyes to a pelvis is a longer distance than eyes to bounding box, causing the check to have a smaller range than melee attacks, even though it's 1.2 times longer. The dilemma here is that I'm not sure if this can truly be called a mistake. If we pretend that the coder originally intended for the check to be a bit longer than melee range, it's possible that they decided not to fix the broken code because they realized the check might be too forgiving. Since the code simply checks for distance, allowing forgiveness for the full melee range might allow too many false positives, where you entirely miss but the game forgives you. In its current state, it actually wouldn't have that many false positives. The other issue is that crouching is also weird, which also makes it more ambiguous what the forgiveness check is really meant to do. First of all, crouching brings your eyes more level with the pelvis, so crouching allows you to qualify for forgiveness at a greater distance. Here, I can miss as much as I want while crouched, but as soon as I stand up, I start hitting myself. This doesn't seem like what you would intentionally design since it's just weird and unintuitive. If you never watched this video, how would you ever realize that crouching made the forgiveness check more generous? There's also no way to be in forgiveness range when you are on top of another player. Whether you're standing or crouching, you're always too far to be forgiven. It's not like being on top of someone's head and using your melee weapon is some insanely overpowered strat that would be made worse by the forgiveness check. So, it could be the case that Valve scrapped it together, and it kinda works, so they just left it at that. I can kinda see it going either way, so it's a matter of what you personally think is more likely. On the bright side, we now know how to be the perfect Boston Basher user. Crouch as you swing. Valve never make mistakes, and you know, Valve be super powerful. I think we've nailed it.